Sir John Cowdery Kendrew, the 24th of March 1917 to the 23rd of August 1997, was an English biochemist and crystallographer who shared the 1962 Nobel Prize in Chemistry with Max Peretz. Their group in the Cavendish Laboratory investigated the structure of heme-containing proteins. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Education and early life. He was born in Oxford, son of Wilfred George Kendrew, reader in climatology in the University of Oxford, and Evelyn May Graham Sandberg, art historian. After prep school at the Dragon School in Oxford, he was educated at Clifton College in Bristol, 1930–1936. He attended Trinity College, Cambridge in 1936, as a major scholar, graduating in chemistry in 1939. He spent the early months of World War II doing research on reaction kinetics, and then became a member of the Air Ministry Research Establishment, working on radar. In 1940 he became engaged in operational research at the Royal Air Force Headquarters, holding the honorary rank of Wing Commander RAF. He was awarded his Ph.D. after the war in 1949. <laughs> research and career During the war years, he became increasingly interested in biochemical problems, and decided to work on the structure of proteins. Crystallography In 1945 he approached Max Peretz in the Cavendish Laboratory in Cambridge. Joseph Barcroft, a respiratory physiologist, suggested he might make a comparative protein crystallographic study of adult and fetal sheep hemoglobin, and he started that work. In 1947 he became a Fellow of Peterhouse, and the Medical Research Council MRC agreed to create a research unit for the study of the molecular structure of biological systems, under the direction of Sir Lawrence Bragg. In 1954 he became a reader at the Davy Faraday Laboratory of the Royal Institution in London. Topic. Crystal structure of myoglobin Kendrew shared the 1962 Nobel Prize for Chemistry with Max Peretz for determining the first atomic structures of proteins using X-ray crystallography. Their work was done at what is now the MRC Laboratory of Molecular Biology in Cambridge. Kendrew determined the structure of the protein myoglobin, which stores oxygen in muscle cells. On Saturday, 20 October 1962 the award of Nobel Prizes to John Kendrew and Max Peretz, and to Crick, Watson, and Wilkins was satirized in a short sketch in the BBC TV programme that was the week that was with the Nobel Prizes being referred to as the Alfred Nobel Peace Pools. In 1947 the MRC agreed to make a research unit for the study of the molecular structure of biological systems. The original studies were on the structure of sheep hemoglobin, but when this work had progressed as far as was possible using the resources then available, Kendrew embarked on the study of myoglobin, a molecule only a quarter the size of the hemoglobin molecule. His initial source of raw material was horse heart, but the crystals thus obtained were too small for X-ray analysis. Kendrew realized that the oxygen-conserving tissue of diving mammals could offer a better prospect, and a chance encounter led to his acquiring a large chunk of whale meat from Peru. Whale myoglobin did give large crystals with clean X-ray diffraction patterns. However, the problem still remained insurmountable, until in 1953 Max Peretz discovered that the phase problem in analysis of the diffraction patterns could be solved by multiple isomorphous replacement. Comparison of patterns from several crystals, one from the native protein, and others that had been soaked in solutions of heavy metals and had metal ions introduced in different well-defined positions. An electron density map at 6 angstrom .6 nanometers resolution was obtained by 1957, and by 1959 an atomic model could be built at 2 angstrom .2 nanometers resolution. Topic. Later career. In 1963 Kendrew became one of the founders of the European Molecular Biology Organization, as well, he founded and was for many years editor-in-chief of the Journal of Molecular Biology. He became Fellow of the American Society of Biological Chemists in 1967 and honorary member of the International Academy of Science. In 1974 he succeeded in persuading governments to establish the European Molecular Biology Laboratory in Heidelberg and became its first director. 
From 1974 to 1979 he was a trustee of the British Museum, and from 1974 to 1988 he was successively Secretary General, Vice President, and President of the International Council of Scientific Unions. After his retirement from the European Molecular Biology Laboratory, Kendrew became President of St. John's College at Oxford University, a post he held from 1981 to 1987. Kendrew's entry in Who's Who lists ten other important national and international committees on which he served as either member or chairman. The Kendrew Quadrangle at St. John's College in Oxford, officially opened on 16 October 2010, is named after him. His scientific biography is currently being written by Paul Wasserman. Topic. Publications by Kendrew Topic. References Topic. Further reading Asterisk John Finch, a Nobel Fellow on Every Floor, Medical Research Council 2008, 381 pp, ISBN 978-1-84046-940-0, this book is all about the MRC Laboratory of Molecular Biology, Cambridge. Nobel Website Biography The New York Times Obituary of Kendrew